Welcome back to Outside Rusted Junk Garage. Well, today we have got the <coughs> control panel board out of our Samsung dryer. This part has failed. Um, I'm getting codes, trouble codes, AE, which is telling me that this control board is not communicating with the main circuit board in the dryer and this has been, uh, this is, I diagnosed the problem. When this was hooked up, when I removed it, I could still hook the one plug up and power the dryer up. And this module right here, it was clicking. And that's not supposed to be like this. This is your selector here, and then this is your panel, your on off buttons and all of that. So anyway, this is, this is defective. So we got another one. I bought one on eBay and we're gonna hook that up and test it. And then if it works good, we're gonna mount it in the control panel and get this dryer working again. Well, it appears to be working. I just temporarily hooked the new board up there and I got some damp clothes in there. It started at 44 minutes which is normal and then after a couple minutes they weren't it's not a big load and they weren't real wet they dropped to 22 and now counting down to 21 and it hasn't gone into the default AE mode so I think we're going to be good I'll just put that back in the panel button everything up and I think we're going to be okay so I am happy now let's see how it works. She's a spinning. All right, we're gonna do a load of laundry and see how she turns out. We're 22 minutes into the drying cycle. And with the old control panel in there, this would have gone into a uh, error code. Throwing an AE code means there was a loss of communication between electronic components, which basically means the control panel board. And under here is the main control board for there. So the control panel board was the issue. So I replaced it. Bought a used one on eBay for $25. They want $236 for these if you want to buy a new one. But I bought a used one. Very simple job to put it in. You got your two screws back there. The top slides off. Panel drops down on the front. One, one little plug, one clip, one plug. Eight screws hold it in. Pull it out. Your control button just pops right off there. Reverse the procedure, putting it together. Make sure you either unplug the dryer or go to your uh, breaker box and flip the breaker before doing any work on uh, your appliances. But counting down fine. I think we got the darn thing fixed. This is a, an 11 year old Samsung. Um, it's got all the fancy options on it there, but it, it sure doesn't get used very much. This probably does two loads, uh, two or three loads a month at most. So we're happy. It's fixed. Hopefully it holds together for another 11 years. Thanks for joining us today outside Rusted Junk Garage, working on the appliances. <laughs>